contract, like the employees have to stay on board. Yep. Right? Because I have to take over this. I'm, in, I'm inheriting an ongoing <laughs> business concern. Right. I have to take over it. Yep. I don't know the first thing about Right. About this model. Yeah. All of this. Right. Really There's a lot to learn. Yeah. Yep. Like, I'll drown. Yeah. You know, like, so, um, and then obviously it turned out that they wanted to stay on board. They're like, you know, the sellers are like, hey, are you going to keep your employees on board? And I'm like, yeah, yeah I was going to tell you yeah. the requirement. <laughs> <laughs> Write that in the contract. Exactly. <laughs> to really build them up and bring them back to life. I mean, they, they started with one and it's a gradual process. And that's the thing people, I think people understand. You just want to rush and jump right, right into it at first, but it takes time. Yeah. It takes time. Yep. Sometimes the capital is there. Exactly. Stabilize what you're these guys decided to move on. Yep. 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 And that's the thing, they weren't real estate people. Right. They weren't. So, so they, they were more, what, what, was, what was their uh, vision for it? <laughs> I don't think they had a vision for the whole property itself. Okay. I think they more so just had a vision for the sober house. Okay. And then when they got into the real estate aspect of that project, it, it was too much. The budget, the management, like, the budget, right. They couldn't, budget they couldn't muscle, manage it. Right. They yeah. were like, yeah, we're just going to be these over two. We're going to go. Right, right, right. And so, yeah. you know, I, I, yep. again, I was driving by and I'm like, still sitting there. <laughs> sniper move. Yep. Did you reach out to him? Well, I, I did. You did. I, okay. I pulled up. Yep. Just on a random day. Because yep. again, like, you can almost see one of my other buildings. Right, right, right over there. So you're here every day. You're yeah, driving, so I'm driving every day. past it. So I literally came in on a humble. Yep. And that's when I first met Jean. Okay. I just yep. knocked on the door. Yep. She's looking at me like, like yeah. who's this, yeah. this brother coming up exactly. here? Yep. We don't get any of you. No, i <laughs> But I knocked on the door. Yep. And the owner called me within 24 hours. Wow. Wow, they were ready. Perfect timing, man. Yep. Yep. Wow. And he had uh, already started discussions yep. with someone else. Yep. It was a local nonprofit. And he said, hey, I'll give you first right of refusal if that falls through. Okay. So I was already doing another project around the corner yep. for a building I just picked up. And then uh, I think maybe like six months later, he called me. We, we kept keeping in touch over the months, right? And yep. to be candid, I kind of got a little tired because every time back I called him, yeah, yeah. he was like, oh, one more month. And I called right. him in two months. Oh, give me another month. Right. And I'm like, all right. You know, yeah, like, he's playing games. Yep. And then out of the blue, he just called me up when I was still on that project. He said, hey, still interested? And I was like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so with these rooms, you'll probably get, you obviously put some partition walls up, yep, the bottom right. up, and I mean, these are huge. Yeah, these so this is all this, huge as well. Exactly. So this yep. is pretty much a one bedroom right here. Yeah, this is, I mean, you probably get four beds in here. Yeah. If you do it that way, are you going to cut it down the middle? Yeah, probably just cut, cut it down, down the middle. middle there's, a, there's a partition right there between the exactly. windows. Exactly. Perfect. Yep. I might even, you know, repartition windows or, yeah, right. like there's enough width. Right, to right. Exactly. Right. 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 right in there. Yep. Exactly. You got living room, kitchen, I yep. off one of the entrances, probably leave that one open and come straight into the kitchen. Yep. And obviously, nice. if I made it a studio, I could probably put a, you know, thing down the middle. Yep. And that might even be a better way to go. Right, exactly. You know, exactly. Square foot. Right, yep, that's where it's at. Be yep. Off. yep. More units, so. more revenue. Exactly. Uh, more, more that you can serve. Yep. That's you know something about real estate sitting vacant, man. It just makes me uneasy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's an opportunity. It's, it's an that's right. That's right. That's, yep. right. that's, that's right. That's an opportunity. Yep. That's the thing that makes me excited about it. Like, yep. You see it in its raw form. Yep. And you can you can come up with a vision, right? And then once you start the renovation, life, the redevelopment man. process, and you see it come to fruition, you're like. Oh man, yeah. Right, exactly. This, exactly. this could be man. good. This is it. This yep. could be good. <laughs> yep, yep. It's a great feeling. Very rewarding. That's where I'm at Very rewarding. right now. Like every old framing is done and yep. I'm looking, I'm like, oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> I gotta put a new retaining wall up. You nice. Know, neighbors are driving by. They love it. Yeah. Thanks yeah. coming out for the inspection. <laughs> like that retaining wall is <laughs> impressive. Like, right? Yeah, it's it's coming change, together. changes the whole feel of, yep. of the house and the community. That's right. Yep. <laughs> so as you can see, this, this is part of, you know, so many buildings. This is what I love, like just the raw form. Yep. Because to us, we see opportunity. Hundred percent. To other people, that's the value add right there. Yeah. yeah. You know, <laughs> you know, if you're not battle tested yet. Yep. Yeah, I got to talk you through. You know what I'm like, saying? What like, what am I gonna do? Yeah, yeah like this place is falling yep. apart. It's right. like, yep. Yeah, it's falling apart. I'll buy it for a dollar. Right, there you go. <laughs> Give it to me. I know what to do. You know what to do with it, man. No, it's hundred percent. I mean, I look at these houses. I'm so, so desensitized to it too. I've been doing it for so many years. That's yeah, right. You just see your battle test. Right. right, right. That's it. Yep. You know, it's just a matter of turning the crank. Yep. You got you it. Know? You got it. Yeah. And when you get, you know, I mean, by many standards, 
this is a small asset. Yes. Right? Oh yeah. yeah. But yeah. Compared to some of the bigger stuff, right? Yeah, yeah. And, and it's all relative to some people. This would be yep. a bigger purchase, right? So um, again, go back to the whole project. I bought that thing. I was like, yeah. <laughs> How many units did you do there? Uh, 18. 18 was like, wow, that's a good size. Yeah, good size, yeah. man. Yeah. But it was like, I bought it for a price where I was like, I can't go wrong. You couldn't pass on it. Yeah, exactly. Can't you can't lose. lose. Yep, yep. I, I, I almost went wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I had to hold on for four years. Yep. To, to read four, started, yep. you know, work. Yep, yep. And yep. fight litigation, but I mean, it was still at such a good price point where it's still still made sense. Yeah, still no, beneficial. that's that's how it is, man. It's like you said, patience. Yeah. Having that patience and understanding in this game will yeah. go a long way. You go a lot further than trying to just be rash and rush. That's yep. right. Yep. And then the capital. Right, capital as well. To right. Little weather, yep. A little weather, a little bit of right. you know, adversity. Yep. Right? Um, it makes you more durable. 100%. Right? So, I mean, if I only had like one year runway, I'd be right. like, yep. like financial runway. Right, right, exactly. Out of it. Exactly. Yep. 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 A long yep. time ago. I would have to sell it or something. Just sell, just, just, just get liquidate, out. Liquidity. Yeah. yeah. And, yep, yep. You know, cut your losses yeah. and move on, which a lot keep, of guys do sometimes. Yep. Exactly. Just let me keep my shirt and socks. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> right. Just take the keys and I'm out. Yep. <laughs> but with this one, um, I might be able to squeeze like a two bedroom into this apartment. In this yep. Yeah. These old open concept living, living room kitchen area. Right. You got two beds in the back. Yep. 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 Yeah, no, lots of potential here. So in this floor, uh, there's enough for the, these classrooms, easily four right here, right? Right. Yep. Um, the building kind of shuts down, and then that front part is one story. Yep. So I would box that in. You would call it, yeah, exactly, yeah. Because you add additional yep. I got living two area. One two right there, yep. There you go. If you look up, the ceiling is easily, what, 16, right. 18 feet? Yep. Right? There's actually more space above that. There is, so you can add another. So yeah, now, within, within the envelope, you can actually right. expand. That's so great. now I have it's three stories tall, so I can potentially yeah, yep. just have another a third story. Third story, right? So I still have more work to do to figure out if that's feasible. Yep. But yep. the structure the height support is there. The height is there. Yeah, that, that's the height yeah. is there. Yep. Now that's so the now thing. you throw six more units upstairs, at least four. Four, so exactly. Right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. No, that, that makes a lot of sense, man. So yep. my architect came out here and we did a walkthrough and I think he was able to get the unit count up to like 25 and I'm like, wow. dude, like he's like shoehorning, you know? <laughs> I mean, he's shoehorning like apartments. Micro units, micro it's, units. It's micro units in yeah. the basement. I'm right, like, right. I don't know about the basement apartment. Right. Like, oh, you can do this, dude. Yeah. I'm like, yeah. that's why I brought you here, <laughs> but I might scale it back to 20. You yeah, know? yeah, like, no, nah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's, it's feasibility is, is, you know, in reality, different than all That's people. right, that's, that's right. right. It needs to be marketable. Right, it has, has to be. You yep. know, it's yep. like, you can't show the apartment in the basement <laughs> with a chalk outline, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it's never gonna rain. Yep. <laughs> with no windows. Yep, <laughs> yep. It's a great, great project, great building. Yeah. Now, what are, you, what are you gonna put the building in the middle? Yeah, so that one is still to be determined. Okay. Uh, I've had conversations with uh, a veterans organization. Yep. And they did a great project where they actually took a Pullman church and converted it into like a great hall. Wow. And they built housing for the veterans. 